Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about a strong number. The definition is if sum of factorial of its digit is equal to number itself. So suppose if I enter 145, if I do sum of factorial of its digit or uh, factorial 1 plus factorial 4 plus factorial 5. So the factorial 1 value count 1, factorial 4 value 24, factorial 5, 120. So if I do the sum, then it comes 145. So 145 equal to 145. So this number is equal. So this is a, a strong number. Suppose if I enter 144, if I do factorial of every digit or factorial 1 with some factorial 4 plus factorial 4. So factorial 1 value count 1, factorial 4, 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 plus 4 into 3 into 2 into 1. So 1 plus this value come 24, 4 into 3 into 2, 24. And this value also come 24. So if you do sum, then the value come 49. 24 plus 24, 48, 48 plus 1, 49. So 49 equal to 144. So it's not equal. So this is a not a, a strong number. So let's uh, do it in programming. Next, I'm going to discuss about the try and method of this program. So, if you debug the code, control comes to main function. Here, after that, coincides. So, actually, I have taken all six individual variables. First is n. Next, i. Fact. Rim. And sum. So sum initialized to 0 right here and one more variable tam. So it is your functions what we dual code that displaying to the output screen into a number. 
and whatever I'm going to enter, so that is by n. So I'm going to enter n value 145. Here after n value go to tan. So tan become 145. And uh, while loop, so n greater than 0. 145 greater than 0, condition is true, so that coincide. So at here i value initialized to 1, fact value initialized to 1. Here after n equal to n more 10, so 144, sorry, 145 more 10. So right here, if you divide, then it divide by 14 times and remainder come 5. So mod operator return remainder. So right here, rem become 5. Here after while loop, while i less than equal to rem. So i value is now 1 and rem value is 5. So 1 less than equal to 5, condition is true, so that coincides, so right here, fact equal to fact into i. So 1 into fact value 1, i value 1, 1 into 1, so fact will become 1. Here after i increase, so i is 2 now. And here after that go, check the condition 2 less than equal to rim. So 2, i value is 2, rim value is 5. So 2 less than equal to 5, condition is 2, so fact equal to fact into i. So fact value is 1, i value is 2, 1 into 2, fact it become 2 now. Here after i increase, so i is 3 now. Check the condition 3 less than equal to 5, condition is true, so that coincide fact equal to fact into i. So fact value is now 2, i value is 3, 2 into 3, fact become 6. Here after i increase, so i is 4 now. Check the condition 4 less than equal to 5, condition is true, so that coincide fact equal to fact into i. So fact value is 6, i value is now 4, 6 into 4, fact become 24. Here after i increase, so i is 5 now. Right here, check the condition 5 equal to 5. I value is 5, rim value is 5. 5 equal to 5, condition is true. So that coincides. So right here, fact equal to fact into i. So fact value is 24, i value is 3. So fact will become 120. Now here, after i increase, so i is 6 now. Check the condition 6 less than equal to. Uh, rim value is 5, 6 less than equal to 5, condition is not true, so that not coincide here, sum equal to sum plus fact. So sum value is 0, fact value 120. So sum become 120 at here. Here after n equal to n by 10, so 145 by 10, so it divide by 20 times, so n become 14. Here after that go up and Check the condition while n greater than 0. So 14 greater than 0, condition is true. So i start from 1 again and fact is start from 1 again. Rim equal to n more 10. So n value is now 14, 14 more 10. So at here, remainder come 4. So rim become 4 at here. Now here after while i less than equal to rim. So i value is 1, rim value is 4. So 1 less than equal to 4, condition is true, so that coincide fact equal to fact into i. So 1 into 1, fact become 1, i increase, so i is 2 now. Here after go up, check the condition, i less than equal to rim, so i value is 2, rim value is 4, 2 less than equal to 4, condition is true, so that coincide fact equal to fact into i. So fact value is now 1, i value is now 2, so 1 into 2, fact become or 2. Here after i increase, so i is 3 now. Check the condition 3 less than equal to 4. Condition is true, so that coincide fact equal to fact into i. So fact value is 2, i value is 2. Oh sorry, i value is 3. So 2 into 3, fact become 6. Here after i increase, so i is 4 now. Check the condition 4 equal to 4, condition is true. So that coincides, so right here. Fact equal to fact into i. So fact value is now 6. i value is now 4. So 6 into 4. Fact value 24. Here after i increase, so i is 5 now. Check the condition 5 less than equal to 4. Condition is not true, so that not coincide. Here after control comes to this point. Sum equal to sum plus fact. So sum value is now 120. And fact value is 24. So that becomes 1. 44. Here after n equal to n by 10, so 4 by 14 by 10, so it divide by 1 times. Now here after go up, check the condition 1 greater than 0, condition is true, so i start from 1 again, and fact is start from 1 again. 
So add you Rim equal to M more thing. So one more thing, Rim equal to one. Here have to check the condition while i less than equal to rim. So i value is one, rim value is one. One equal to one, condition is true. So that coincide fact equal to fact into i. So fact value is now uh, one. I value is also one. One into one, fact become one. Here after i increase, so i is two now. That go check the condition two less than equal to one. Condition is not true. So that not coincide. Here after control comes to this point. Sum equal to sum plus fact. So sum value is now 144 and i value is now sorry uh, fact fact value is 1 so total become 145 so here after n equal to n by 10 so 1 by 10 remain to uh, n become 0 here after that go check the condition 0 greater than 0 condition is not true so that not go, go inside here after if sum equal to sum to value equal to tan so sum value is now 144 145 and tan value is also 145 so condition is true so that coincides so actually or tan value that bit 145 and whatever in double code that display so the output come 145 is a strong number and here after that output main function so if you enter m 145 so the output come 145 is a strong number So this time I'm going to enter n value 143. So n value go to tan. So tan become 143. Here after while n greater than 0. So 143 greater than 0 condition is true. So that coincides. So i value start from 1. Fact value start from 1. So rim equal to n mod 10. So 1 mod 143 mod 10. So rim come or 3 at here. Now here after while i less than equal to rim so i value is now 1 and rim value is 3 so 1 less than equal to 3 condition is true so that coincide fact equal to fact into i so 1 into 1 fact will become 1 here after i increase so i is 2 now so that go check the condition i value is 2 rim value is 3 so 2 less than equal to 3 condition is true so that coincide fact equal to fact into i so fact value is now 1 and i value is 2 so 1 into 2 so fact will become 2 here after i increase so i is 3 now or check the condition 3 less than equal to rim value is 3 3 equal to 3 condition is true so that coincide so fact equal to fact into i so fact value is now 2 i value is 3 2 into 3 fact become 6 here after i increase so i is 4 now that curve check the condition 4 less than equal to rim value is 3 so 4 less than equal to 3 condition is not true so that not coincide so control comes to this point, sum equal to sum plus fact. So sum initially is next slash to 0 and uh, 0 plus uh, fact value 6. So sum becomes 6 at here. So n equal to n by 10. So it divide by 14 times. So n become 14. Now here after that go check the condition 14 greater than 0. Condition is true. So i value start from 1 again. Fact value is n is less to 1 again. So rim equal to n more 10. So n value is now 14. 14 more 10. So remainder come at here 4. So rim become 4 at here. Now while loop i less than equal to rim. So i value is now 1 and or rim value is 4. So 1 less than equal to 4 condition is true. So that coincide. So at here fact equal to fact into i. So fact is now 1. i value is 1. 1 into 1. Fact become 1. Here after i increase. So i is 2 now. Check the condition 2 less than equal to 4 condition is true. So that coincide. Fact equal to fact into i. So fact is now 1, i value is 2, 1 into 2, fact will become 2. Here after i increase, so i is 3 now. Check the condition 3 less than equal to 4, condition is 2, so that going to coincide, fact will to fact into i. So fact value is 2, i value is 3, so 2 into 3, fact will become 6. Here after i increase, so i is 4 now. Check the condition 4 less than equal to 4, condition is 2, so that coincide, fact will to fact into i. So fact value is 6, i value is now 4, 6 into 4, fact value 24. Here after i increase, so i is 5 now. And uh, check the condition, 5 less than equal to 4, condition is not true, so that not coincide here, sum equal to sum plus fact. So sum value is now 6 and fact value is 24. So I tell you, 24 plus 6, that becomes 30. Here after 
n equal to n by 10, so 14 by 10, so n become 1 at here. That go, check the condition, 1 greater than 0, condition is 2. So i value start from 1 again, and fact value start from 1 again. Rim equal to n more 10, so 1 more 10, rim become 1. Here out to y, i less than equal to rim, so i value is now 1, rim value is 1, 1 equal to 1, condition is 2, so fact equal to fact into i, so 1 into 1, fact equal to 1. i increase, so i is 2 now. That go up, check the condition, 2 less than equal to, rim value is 1, so 2 less than equal to 1, condition is not true, not coincide here after, sum equal to sum plus fact. So sum value is now 13, 13, and fact value at your 1. So 13 plus 1, that become 31. Here after n equal to n by 10, so 1 by 10, n become 0. Here after that go up, check the condition, 0 greater than 0, condition is not true. So control comes to this point at here. If sum double equal to tan, so sum value is now 31. Sum value is 31 and tan value is 143. So both are not equal. So that go to as part at here. Or see out. So tan value is the display 143 is not a, a strong number. And here after that outflow main function. So this is the dry method of this program. So I hope guys you understand. So thanks for watching, see you next week.